Wonderful people, viewers, and subscribers, it is my pleasure to bring you this video because I know if you see this one and jump and pass. Oh, yes. You see, as Nigerian political elites and leaders, as they so call themselves, continue to rob Nigerian people name for shame, eh? for mud. Nigerian youths, exceptional Nigerian youths, have been making us proud. And it is my pleasure to bring to you our finest, our own very finest, Informa Amuche. Informa Amuche, if you don't know, is the best graduating student in, in her university all the way from China. China, Chinko. And if you must know, Ifoma Muche is a native of Asia above village. Asia above village is in Oko community. My own very Oko, my own Oko. Hey, hey. Now this one I told Miche. And Oko is in Orum, but not local government in Anambra State. Anambra State is in Igbo land. The Biafran land. As I am so proud. And also a Nigerian by citizen and African by extension. Now, let us review this very video. As my sister, they are wank chinko like an atakara. Henrunsinda 但我很快发现，学火菜西南大学学古诗一点也不难。下雨时走在玉兰花下，我感受到了夜来风雨声，花落知多少。起风时来到樟树林，我明白了鸟鸣山更幽，蝉噪林雨静。春天漫步成德
，君不见，高堂明镜悲白发，朝如青丝暮成雪。当我背诵完，全场掌声雷动。感谢母校，谢母校给了我站上舞台的能力和勇气。我爱西南大学，从一个汉语都说不好的老外，变成了能流利朗诵唐诗宋词的西大学子。我不想快乐的时光变成春花秋月何时了，往事知多少。所以我选择留在母校读研究生。我将继续在这里探索传统文化的魅力，汉阳文化传播的能力。优秀赞人的文化不仅是中国的，也应该是世界的。期待有一天，通过我们共同的努力，能让中华文化变成九万里，风朋正举，变成天天生我材必有用，变成天下谁人不识君。谢谢大家。谢谢陈月同学。Hey, nah, this one, this one, this one too much. She has my sister. They just they they shop shinko like chewing gum. Honestly, I'm so proud of her. For her, all the way from Africa, Nigeria, Igbo land, particularly Anambra State, specifically Oko, my own community, traveled all the way to Chinko and graduated. As the best student in Chinese language, in Chinese language, some of you will say, "Oh, why would she be studying Chinese language?" Let me tell you, in case you don't know, China is taking over the world economy, and as they are spreading their economic tentacles across the world, they need people like this. In fact, it is becoming another second language, just like we are speaking grammar, like saying our own. Grammar not be our own, but today we have professors in English and all of that. And the one big deal about this whole thing is that my people, although we are trying to, you know, discourage that in terms of going to import and import, we need to start producing here. But I can tell you, if we must attract expertise, if we must attract businesses and open up opportunities, she is. Standing in a very powerful position to mediate, to interpret, and also to even teach our people, especially those who are traveling to China to go and buy goods, or Chinese people coming here to trade. You see, it's a good thing, and I'm so proud of her. Okay, it's a good thing. I am so proud of her, and as much as I'm proud of her, I'm also proud of my Iboness and our Iboness. It doesn't remove anything away from her being Ibo. That is the truth. Okay, but it is expanding opportunity, and I appreciate her for making us proud. My only problem is that our political class are not doing as much as the same. Oh yes, they are not, you know, making us proud. As our young chaps, we've seen them across the world doing good, bagging awards, and coming out as the best graduating students of their various universities across the world. But what we get is people who are breaking boundaries in being the most corrupt political leaders in the world. We've seen them convicted in different prisons and all of those things, having very bad record of drug dealings. <laughs> you know that. <laughs> Well, that is by the way, Sha. I want to say we appreciate you, the former Mute, my own very sister. We are proud of you. Oko community, we celebrate you. We, the Igbos, we celebrate you because you are an asset to us. If you like it, encourage her. Let us spread the news by sharing it. Hit on the subscription button and don't forget to share this video to everyone so that the world will know that we. A people to be proud of. Bye bye for now.